Sigurd, is there a problem? We'll go see Tomna. Just the two of us. Ivar and Uba will wait here. Better if Tomna thinks we've come alone. The truth is, I don't think any of us can stop Ivar from cleaving her head open. It's all he was spewing the whole way over here. Right. Shall we? We'll return shortly. A small fortune for whoever sent Tona to hell. I'll hold you to that. From what I overheard in Repton, the brothers had an arrangement with Tona. What happened? She's a mercenary. Uba used her for man and information. But that relationship soured now that Burgret is all but defeated. From what I heard, Tona has hunger for two things. Soft silver and a stern hunt. Neither of which earns you true loyalty. If she can't be trusted, what use is she? That is for us to find out. We may be able to satisfy her. And if we can't? Eva did tell you to bring her axe. And here they are, as expected. If she takes a liking to you, keep talking. She's more your type, I think. No, no. This is your challenge. Come now. Don't drag your feet. I should not be seen. Sigurd, what brings you strolling into my camp this brisk day? I suspect you already know. Yes. <laughs> the Empress on the air betrayed me. And yet, if you are here talking to me, King Burgeret remains at large. And who are you, lovely dove? Want to perch your ass on my lap? Not interested. And why not? I've been told I have a rather expert tongue. Only good for yawping, I see. <laughs> Enough blabbering. You know why we're here. Where is King Burgret? That is what you want. And what makes you think I have the slightest idea? We found letters. Records of trade. The two of you have a history. What can I say? The king pays well for my services. If only I could say the same for those two Ragnarsson plots. You're dealing with me now, and I want to know what you know. Name your price. Very well. I could use another cow, and you can cover the cost. Here's your silver. Mm, ripe as a plum, aren't you? So eager. Out with it. Burgred paid me to steer the Ragnarsons clear of two areas. Ledechestre and Templebrochfort. It was a hefty amount. If I were you, that's where I'd look. And that is all I know. Not more, not less. We are done here. Ledechestre. ...and Templebroth fought. Do you know these places? I don't, but the brothers will. I'll bring this news to them. Don't stay around here too long. We've got a king to catch. Sigurd's told us the news. Well done. Ledechester and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Ledechester is a large village. And Templebroch, it's an old military fort. Not much else. Burkrat could be at either one. We should check both. As soon as possible. And what do we do with Tona? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Burkrat now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Drinkit. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me Ledechester then. All by my fucking lonesome. Bring a friend, brother. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. 
Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon. timing we would have stormed the place without you what have you seen soldiers are plenty wagons going in and out that weasel Borgred is here I'm sure of it the bathhouse there and that church see I sent a scout to check them both should be back at any moment now did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templarbra no and if Burkred is hiding here I won't have to there is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. No small tension between you two. Thought you'd be more like-minded. You and Sigurd, you always see eye to eye? More often than not. You are still young. You live to my age, and you will see. The closer you get, the greater the stink that rises. Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkwood slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in. to take Tamworth back from the Danes. We're to secure our food stores first, lay off Frith's orders. Lay off Frith's orders? Ha! The King's grown tired of him, you know. 
That's what all the men are saying. Tired? How do you mean? Are you blind? He questions Burgrid's orders every chance he gets. As done ever since the Danes showed up. Goods they've hidden away. Church is well guarded. Might find a way around. Keep it up, lads. Every little bit helps. Supplies. Burkwood is not giving up without a fight. Guide me. Have you lost your mind? I feared you were one of them. Keep quiet. What are you doing here? I'm... I was looking for Burgred. You are Eva's scout. 
I hoped I might find Burgreg myself and talk him into surrendering. But he's not in Leatherchester. How can you be sure? Leofrith passed this way with some men. I eavesdropped. It seems they're only stockpiling food here, but he did say something of interest. Gave orders to send more men to Burgred's wife, the Lady Arvilswith. She's in Templebloch. She would know where Burgred's hiding. You hear that? The sounds of battle. Let's, let's get you out of here, now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. Speak up. I... I don't think so. My God. I didn't want it to come to this. They would have killed you, Chilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move. I'll be back. Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our father, grant me salvation. <laughs> When does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You are reckless, Ivar. Jailbird could have been killed. Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his balls? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Ivar who sent me. I sent myself. Have caution, boy. Until your father is crowned, you are Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burkrit's Lady Athelswith is in Templebroth. I'm going to find out what she knows.
never say anything again. We've told you everything. Won't you let us go? Aver, there you are. What's with the prisoners? Man from the fortress, out on patrol. We squeeze them. Berger's not here. It's his queen they're guarding. Others with him. They must have separated after Tomworth. I heard as much from Chelbert and Leather Chester. Chelbert? What was he doing there? Ivar. Too long a tale for now, but he's fine. I sent him to Repton. What's the plan here? It won't be long before someone comes looking for these men. We need to get inside and find Adel's with. Capture a queen to find a king. It might work. Only one way to find out. See if you can get anything more out of them. Me and Aber will take care of fetching Adel's with. Oh, then guide you. The Saxons won't welcome us through the front door. We could find a quiet way in, or we can take your longship. I'm beside you either way. Ah, oh, Eber. I have dreamt of this day. Of scouring the Shire in search of a king. Of going a viking good. With you. With our brothers and sisters. Nice, Zunin. Of going a viking good. With you. With our brothers and sisters. Conquering you. Lands, forming lasting friendships, and if it takes chasing some weasel across a new land, so be it. I am right where I wish to be. As am I, brother. I should be cautious around here. I need your eyes, my friend.
there's method to these cuts. A bandit rabble, but a trained sex of warrior. Scurry. Lady Avaswith, I see Burgred has done his best to hide you away. But what is lost must always be found. Let my handmaidens walk free of this place. They have nothing to do with our quarrel. You hear that, Eivor? Noble. Selfless. 
This is the sword you must strike a bargain with. A woman of quality. We seek only your king, lady. Tell us where Budred hides, and we will leave without an ounce of blood spilled. Please, I... I don't... I don't know. Effective, Sigurd. She is only naive to her present danger. But she will soon understand. Wait. Those are the hands of one who washes linens. A servant. She is a decoy. Watch the handmaidens. I'll follow Athol's with. Uh. Remain steadfast. you are doing at once. Don't you dare put your hands on me. Quite clever, your ladyship. You're certainly making us work for it. Keep your hands off me, pagan! Have you lost your sense of hospitality? I regret asking. Let me go! I demand it! After what you put me through, I would have to be mad. Do you understand what you're doing, Pagan? I am the Lady of Mercia! You're wasting your time. I won't talk. Not to you, not to any of you barbarians. You may reconsider, if only for your people. For who knows how many more might die at the hands of us barbarians. You don't frighten me. Then you are a fool. with you have seen better days god will sear your soul heathen if he can find it why the cat chamber she is as much a poet as you where's my Kathleen? what have you done with her your handmaiden you mean the brave one dressed in royal finery season change with the others i'll take them back to tamworth get them talking if she has so much as a scratch on her I will inform Cheerwald. He might have some ideas on how to get through to her. I will meet you there. Sigurd, what about these prisoners? We've got what we need. Let them go. <clears throat> My thanks. God bless what you. What is going on now?
your turn. She won't talk to me. Aver will handle it. Go on. You have exhausted my friend Uber here, but I'm wide awake. Maybe tell me where Burkrit is hiding and let him rest happy. Never. Stone-faced and tight-lipped. All for a king who hides like a cowardly vole, too scared to protect his family and his people. Thirsty? <laughs> My husband does what he must for Mercia. How could he do otherwise, knowing that even his closest friends could betray him? Give that traitor Cheowulf my message. He may win this earthly battle, but the devil has won the war for his soul. Cheowulf is a Mercian doing his best to find common footing in this new land. Seems to be the only true Mercian by my reckoning. I spit on him. Whatever life he makes in Mercia will be built on the graves of the nobles who gave their lives to defend it. The longer you drag this out, the truer that becomes. We've taken Repton, Tamworth, now Tumblebroth, and Letterchester. With each victory, your hope for peace recedes. Yet Borgred has what you do not. The loyalty of his people. Good men. Faithful men. Who? The Thanes and Chills of Mercia? No, no. Only Leofrid remains loyal, and he too will fall. Yes, goodly Leofrid. He will die defending his king. And win or lose, he will send a hundred more of you to hell. Eivor, your ladyship, do not mind me. Only here to count my spoils. Oh, God! Pigs have to eat, my lady. The trouble is, it takes a lot to sate their hunger. Only a matter of time before they finish those and sniff around for fresher meat. And the smell of pig shit after this? Ooh. My... my god! Get me out of here! Please! Talk now, and we'll draw you a nice warm bath. You... You are asking me to betray my husband. How can I do that? If you don't, you will betray countless others. In legend. You may be remembered as the king and queen who abandoned their kingdom in its darkest hour. But there will be peace. This is Jailwolf's promise, and it will be honored. You have my word. Does the caged bird sing? Burkrit is hiding, in an old crypt to the south. ...where the Alne and Arrow Rivers join. A crypt? Now tell me this is not a sign from the gods. It's a long way to carry a king. The three of you must clear a path back to Tamworth. Where can we meet? Bring him to the bridge at Venonus. There's a straight line through. We'll deal with any trouble there. Heads were a nice touch. I'm not one for spectacle, but it got her talking. Spectacle? That's just me. Pile the soldiers here. Let these people bear witness to the carnage that awaits their kingdom. Ha! 
survey the area soon. Heavy guard for a musty crypt. Cannot be the dead they're protecting. What's going on? Briars might hide you. Got to be down here. Where are you hiding, Bagret? Sneeze loud enough, and these walls will come down, looks like.
must be getting close. No, no, it can't be! Stay back! That's a bread knife, my lord. Do you mean to butter me? Stay back! Back, I say! I'll fight you! If you insist. You'll have to kill me! I won't let you, you defeat won't come me! To that. This kingdom is mine! Mine! Time to go, my lord. We're late for the crowning ceremony. this thing you, you, you think you've won you haven't liar Frith. I, I sent him away with orders to destroy you quiet the mess you're in you don't know the half of it. You're a blight on this world. The whole lot of you. A rancid disease. You don't deserve Mercia. To the victor, the spoils, my lord. You must win Mercia to deserve her. Ah! 
way! We need to go! Fast! Right behind you. I told you we need to set fire to the house so the raid feels real. Here we are. Look familiar? No! No, you... You godless slugs! Yeah. You won't get away with this! Change has come, Burgred. All that remains is a coronation. A return with the Lords of Mercia. Burgred, my love! My lady, are you injured? Did they hurt you? No, no. I'm fine. Move along, Lord. Your king awaits. Your death will come, Danes. Your end was writ the moment you came for me. I have made damn sure of that. The Zealots will know your name soon enough. No matter where you are or how far you travel, they will hunt you down. Enough of that, you squeaking sparrow. <laughs> Let my brother be the lunatic of Tamworth. Zealots? What does he mean? Ignore him. Desperate pleas and prophecies. Nothing more. Walk with me, Wolfkist. We have some time before the ceremony. Where to? Nowhere in particular. I only want to celebrate. Didn't think you were the type. You have drawn a dark conclusion about me, haven't you? <laughs> 